John Life here, and today I'll be doing my top five favorite mounts in Wizard 101. So this is my first face cam in Wizard 101. If you guys enjoy it, make sure to hit that thumbs up button if you enjoyed it. Uh, make sure to tell me if you like this face cam. I might do it more often in Wizard 101. It depends on what you guys think of it. So I'm just going to do a video for you guys about my top five favorite mounts. Uh, we'll be doing a walkthrough very shortly, everyone. If you're waiting for the walkthroughs, I definitely will get those ready for you. Uh, in the meantime, let's get right started on the mounts. So uh, my number 5 mount was going to be the B-Wing mount, instead it didn't work on X-Split, and now I had to do it on OBS. Uh, things just didn't want to work on OBS, I mean, uh, on X-Split. So guys, actually my number 5 mount was right here, everyone. The B-Wing mount, the B-Wing mount is from the Hive. Uh, it's just a really good mount, you know, it's like almost all the other mounts. Example, something like the Fairy Wing mounts in a way. But it's a really, really good mount in my opinion, that's why it's in the top number 5 spot out of my mounts here. So, that is the reason why the B-Wing mount is at the number 5 spot. Alright. Number 4 that I have to pick, guys, is probably the Trent mount. The Trent mount is the first mount I got when I first created this account. I'm so excited. I'm so psyched that I got this mount when I first got it. And I'm always going to love it, and that's exactly why it's at the number top 4 spot. Uh, it was gifted by a friend named Mary Silverheart, if she's ever watching this video. Thank you, Mary Silverheart, for watching. Uh, not for watching, but for gifting me this mount. I really enjoy it. I will never get rid of it. It's always going to be locked and everything. It's one of my favorite mounts in Wizard 101. Easily, easily, easily. She spent 15,000 crowns on me uh, when I first created John Life. Uh, not John Life, but when I first created Jonathan Life before that other account uh, got hacked. So, that is the reason why definitely the trend is at the number 4 spot, everyone. Alright guys, let's head on to number 3. So, the number 3 spot, everyone, is actually going to be the Terror Dog Mount. Now let me explain why the Terror Dog Mount is at the number 3 spot. It is from the Terror Horde Pack, everyone, if you didn't know that. I, I greatly enjoy this mount. They did a really like, I'm trying to think of the word, fantastic job on it. It's really cool. Uh, and the Terror Horde Pack, not the Terror Horde Pack, but the, yeah, the Terror Horde Pack is like a beast pack. Gets a pretty good mount. I love this mount. Uh, never gonna get rid of it either. It's just a really beast mount. It looks like a dog. Someone said it looked like a frog or something. I was like, what? Cause it, 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 it like walks weird. But I don't know. It's at my number three spot easily. It's a really good mount. So good job on that, King Zal. Uh, really good mount. All right. So number two was a pretty tricky one. It was between the balance world because I am balanced, and it was between the mighty seed. Now it was tricky, and I'm thinking right now as I'm still creating this video, as I'm still recording the video, I gotta thank everyone. The balance war one mount is gonna be my number two mount. The texture, the style of it, really cool, and I'm also just balanced. So and because I'm balanced, so of course it's gonna be like in the second spot because it's amazing looking. Uh, it's not one of the best war one mounts. In my opinion, if you watch one of my videos on it, it's definitely not one of my favorite mounts. But it is really good. It's definitely the second one. And it just looks really cool because it's balanced and I'm balanced. And I'm really excited about that. And I'm happy I did get this mount because it was really worth it. So, guys, let's get to number one. As we all know, one of my favorite mounts in the, in the game. It'll always be. It will never, ever get beaten probably. Well, Wonky the Donkey was really hard to beat because the April Fool mount pretty good uh, the sloth was also pretty good but over all of those other mounts the mighty steed the mighty steed is so amazing it's just really cool uh, it looks cool it's like you do amazing mount an amazing mount it's just you know very plain but it's a really amazing mount coconut mount really good job on that I love that mount so guys, that is the top five mounts. This is a really short video, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this. Make sure to leave a thumbs up if you did. All right, guys, I will end this video. Please subscribe, comment, like, and share, guys. And as of always, guys, I will see you in the next video.